if I can uh, if I can try to get people aboard, I'm going to try to do this. I'm going to try to give the, the Westmorelands what they need out there. We're leveling off. We won't have as much put in this year in the way of build-up that we had last year. We've been at this thing only since July 65, about a year and a half. We have turned it around in a year and a half. Uh, we've been at the poverty thing about uh, two years and a half, and we have turned it around considerably, and we're on the uh, move in both places, and I'm going to continue to be on the move in the fight uh, on two fronts, uh, the fight against uh, aggression and the fight against uh, the uh, uh, ancient enemies, and we're going to uh, uh, move on both fronts with full steam. Um, uh, if you would call up and say, no, I'm out of this thing, but uh, uh, the president has sent word. I wouldn't say I talked to him at all. The president has sent word to me that uh, he didn't want to uh, get me involved in a lot of things uh, outside of my sphere. But uh, he and I have uh, had the same outlook for a long, long time on some of these things. He wants to talk to me on some domestic. Things. And I want to be brought up to date so that I can talk. And Bill, uh, I have the impression that we ought to go ahead on the, the uh, ancient enemy front, that is health, and that is disease, and that is education, and that is illiteracy, and that is conservation, and, and uh, those things. And uh, while we are unemployment's down, we haven't got everything whipped, and I want to ask you this. Uh, how can we do that without asking for a little taxes? If we have a budget of 135 to 140 billion, we will have a deficit from 15 to 20 billion unless we have a tax bill. No economist in this country I haven't been able to find one that recommends more than 5 billion out of the economy. And they all do that only on one consideration that you put about that much back in Social Security. They think everything's softening. They think you got a very soft spring. They think it, the 17 to 18 percent capital investments dropped to five. And uh, they see American Motors laying a bunch of people off. And they're all scared to death. Uh, they see the taxes. They estimated we'd have taxes next year of $124 billion. It's down to 119 now, $5 billion in the last three weeks. Uh, so they're free. The Council Economic Advisors are the damnedest uh, uh, liberals you ever saw. But uh, uh, two months ago, they wanted a 10% tax bill. They won't even go for a five one today. Now, I don't know this, but I was told this morning, when I hung up the phone, I called you uh, just to visit, because I'm going out and meet the press in about 30 minutes. And uh, I just wanted to philosophize some with you. Uh, I've talked to two people, Joe Califano and you, this morning, but uh, I was uh, told that uh, that bill worked yesterday. Didn't think we could afford a tax bill. Now, I believe uh, that we will not get a tax bill. And I don't believe that it is absolutely imperative that this rich country, uh, I don't think John Rockefeller, John D. Rockefeller, I think he can afford an overdraft for a few months, and I think a rich country can. But I think from a strategical standpoint and from a fiscal standpoint and from an honest standpoint, from a desirable standpoint, the president ought to ask for it. And my feeling is that if the president doesn't ask for it and doesn't show that he's willing to get by on a deficit of less than what Eisenhower had, say 11 or 12, in order to do that, he's got to have a tax bill of five, six, seven. Uh, then they can just take all these damn programs out on the ground that they can't have a twenty billion deficit. Now, my liberals uh, say that you can't have a tax bill because you will cause a recession, and the best way to prevent a recession is to prevent it before it starts. And when you see inventories accumulating, when you see people being cut off, when you see car schedules and housing starts drop from a billion five to eight hundred thousand, you see all these things, the, the indicators that employ people. 
everybody, he's the closest friend of the family, is it regretted? I would say maintained a very dignified aloof of that is not get yourself in the box. They, they'd be very anxious to get you in the picture now. Oh, yeah, sure. And of course, they, the, from all indications, the book's going to be a very bad book. But, uh, but I, would, uh, I would just say uh, that to do along with uh, most, uh, almost all of their Maybe I just say that I don't think that I should have anything to say, and I've asked my, and I've asked.